I'm filming this intro after the footage you're gonna see but I'm basically making new products, new merchandise that I've not made before so tote bags and scrunchies which I'm currently wearing at the moment one of mine it's this uh, silk scrunchie um, and I love it <laughs> so I've made lots to sell so these are the pink ones I've got some brand new woven logo tags to go into my products and they're teeny tiny <laughs> um, but these are so nice so silky softest elastic inside really comfortable and silk is nice and gentle on your hair so I've been using silk scrunchies for ages and I thought why don't I make some and sell some so <laughs> I am I didn't film it because I didn't think it was going to work, but I've just done my first DTF print. Um, I used this tiny little heat press <laughs> that Brian got for me off of the Amazon wishlist. And this is what I've DTF printed. <laughs> and these are pockets to go on my tote bags. And it worked the first time. <laughs> so cute because I always forget to film different steps top line here to secure the lining on the inside uh, and then I do a second line down right here to help secure it to make sure that it doesn't like want to come out <laughs> but how cool is that? I have a floppy bum. I have a floppy bum. <laughs> bun. <laughs> I could go upstairs and get a pin. But I don't know if I can be bothered. Um, incidentally, I'm making scrunchies. So like this one. I'm making scrunchies. They're made of silk. Baby blue and a silver that I'm making at the moment. I'm just starting on another blue one. And I've already got them listed on my website. 
because I'm so eager to get them done. <gasps> that's so good. Look at that. Hopefully this isn't flipped in the actual video. Um, so you can read that. It says, don't mind the fluff. It's part of the design and it's key. Shaking the fluff. So each bag has two pockets, one on either side. So you get two pockets with the print. So I originally had a slightly different colorway of this. So this had a gray border um, and this square was a sort of warm gray. Um, I decided to take the gray box out and just give this a proper color. So there's three bags and there will be one more because I have got another two of the old prints um, done. So there will be four limited edition bags that will only have uh, that will have that original design on um and they are the three of them are listed on the website already so you can go buy those ones because that was the first one i made it was my tester <laughs> um, i love making them so i'm gonna make lots of tote bags i need to get your expert opinion what? i need you to tell me what you think of our new bags what? i've been making some bags <laughs> of you <laughs> i've been making some bags with your face on I have. I have. I need you to tell me what you think. What do you think? Are she rolling? <laughs> Getting a good sniff. What do you think? <laughs> Off the back. <laughs> the bag beside you. What do you think of the new bag? Is it good? No, don't squish it, Key. Do you like the bag? It's got you rolling on it. Yeah. You like to roll. <laughs> yeah, you do. So it's a good bag. <laughs> what do you think of that one? Oh, no, no, don't squash it, Key. Can you back it up? Back it up. We're not putting them there for you to squash. See it. See it right there. Thank you. They're not for squashing. You can sniff and look at them. Just squash them, please. This one says, don't mind the fluff, it's part of the design. Is that true? Don't wipe your nose on them, please. Is that true, Key? <laughs> you don't mind the fluff, it's part of the design. <laughs> when you get a husky, the fluff is part of the design. <laughs> I know. <laughs> fluff is a fact <laughs> of life. I think that needs to be a quote, actually. We've got this one, which is just your handsome face. Good, isn't it? That's your face. Oh. Good job that one's mine, isn't it? Got your nose juices all over it. Hey! Get in! It doesn't smell that good, does it? No, 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 no! Go to take the pocket off! Fucking stop! You're a menace. There's nothing in it. What do you think? <laughs> They're right, are they? They good? <coughs> Put your face on. Do you approve? <coughs> do you approve of your merchandise? <coughs> you do. Good. Do you think people? Should, do you think people should buy some? <laughs> do you think I should make? Do you think I should make lots more? <coughs> well, I could best get to work there, hadn't I? Get lots more made. So these are the three designs at the moment. I absolutely love them. I love making them. Um, I love that they're made from scratch by me. These are my new logo tags. I've even got the care label inside too, which is branded. It says the material and to wash at 30 degrees. Fully lined. Um, I just, I love them. Pocket can fit a small water bottle in. Or you can put your phone in or whatever, keys, whatever you need to just temporarily keep in an outside pocket. They're really big. One that you've seen me use for swimming. Exactly the same pattern, I just used a different fabric. I made this um, a couple of years ago, at least last year. Got my pin badges <laughs> on the side, key pin badges. Um, this was my tester for the canvas. Um, and I decided not to go with the black because of obvious fluff reasons, although it works for that design. 
don't mind the fluff it's part of the design um but i also i just preferred it to have to be all natural canvas color instead of the black but yeah they're designed to last so the stitching you've got two lines of stitching that goes all the way down here stitched across there stitched uh across there twice so the straps are pretty strong um and then you've got the, the lining inside so they're not your average tote bag already sold a few um one of each of them has already gone so i need to make lots more <laughs> before this video comes out on sunday we've got brand new cushion i've also ordered some other brand new cushion designs that um because i'm making the cushions myself now whereas before i would um order the i'd send off my my prints to a company and they would print it out and then sew it all together but they stopped doing the sewing, so they just sent me the panels. Um, so now I am sewing them myself. Um, we have care label inside as well. So they are zipper closure, and this is such a soft faux suede. So nice. Um, and yeah, I <laughs> it's really cute. This one's brand new, it's on the website. Um, and we've got almost all of the cushions in stock at the moment. So head over there. So you've got all of these cushions here that are ready to go. Even Key's paw print one. So it's his paw print painting on a white cushion. Um, and then I will stuff it so you'll get a full cushion. This background is awful. I really went for much longer. This is actually Key's stack of birthday gifts. That's really cute. So thank you so much anyone who sent him a birthday gift. He'll be opening them soon. His birthday is in... April 2nd his birthday is, so he will be opening all of his presents then. Um, but I wanted to end this video by talking about something really exciting um, and why I'm blogging so much of our merchandise right now. Um, because we need to raise some funds for uh, a new project that I want to buy some equipment for. But there's one that I've been wanting to do for years now, uh, but the equipment is very, very expensive. Um, so I haven't been able to. And I didn't want to outsource the making of it because I wanted to do it myself um, and I just decided now's the time, <laughs> gotta do it, gotta buy it, but it does mean that it's a big, big, big expense, it's a big investment and uh, if you'd like to help us out you could go to our website and buy some merchandise, <laughs> help, um, help us buy this piece of equipment, I don't want to reveal what it is just yet. I'll leave that for the next vlog because I've got to do some renovating in order to buy this thing because I don't have space for it. So that's what I'm about to go and do is to go upstairs um, into a room that you've not really seen inside before, um, which is currently, which was currently being used as storage, but we've actually started clearing it out. Um, and then I've got to do some redecorating <laughs> to make it nice enough to actually put this equipment into. It's going to make things that you guys have asked for and that I've been wanting to make for a long time um, and there's so many different things I can do with it <laughs> try and hint at it without actually giving away what it is but yeah we've got a room that was being used as storage it was housing the boxes of Keys plushies these, these guys there's two up there there's two up there I, should, I thought I only had one up there um, so we would really appreciate if you buy some more of those and then we can get rid of some more boxes of key, key plushies, there's actually some in the, that box right there as well. Um, but I've had to move all of those boxes up to the attic out of that room, so <laughs> there we got space for me to do the redecorating. I've got some walls to sand and paint, and then we've got the flooring to do, and then I can look into buying this very expensive piece of equipment. Very, very, very expensive. <laughs> so please help us out and. Uh, buy some of our merchandise and you get some really cool key stuff or you can get some of my jewellery or you can get some of my pottery um scrunchies I've got one in my hair at the moment this is my favorite one in pink I made it <laughs> and I should probably say that the website our website is called designed by um and I'll put a link in the description and in the pin comment if I remember I always forget that so you can go check out what we've got for sale Keys books and plushies and bags. And... I'm constantly uploading new products to the website 
um, restocking old ones. So just keep an eye on it. And we do have the new stock uh, in stock notifier. So if you wanted something um, that's out of stock currently, just fill in your email address and then you'll, it'll let me know that you want it. So I'll know to restock it because uh, I've got so many different like one off things that I've made <laughs> that I don't know if people want to buy more of it. Um, and if you fill in the stock notifier, then I will know you do want it and I will make it. Um, and then it'll send you an email to let you know that it's in stock ready to buy. And we've had a few, well, well I've got 30 in there at the moment. Um, some some products uh, will take me a bit longer to get to, like jewellery. At the moment, I'm not making jewellery things, but I will be. Um, so those some of those will take a bit longer to get round to. Sewing things at the moment are <laughs> top priority. I'm doing a lot of sewing. Um, and the hats, the knitted hats are fully in stock. I know a lot of people are going into spring, but there are still people in winter and you can always stock up for next winter and get yourself a hand knitted hat or a slouchy hat with a key patch on because they're all in stock. Um, I think there's maybe two, two that are out of stock. So I'm about to go put on some overalls and film doing some renovating. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it, but at the same time, it's the not so enjoyable part of sanding, sanding and sanding. I've got to sand walls, a radiator, a window ledge, a door frame and some shelves before I can even begin painting. So that's what my morning is going to be today. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Like, comment, subscribe, all of that stuff. I always forget about that. <laughs> And go to designmyboot.com and have a look and see if there's anything you'd like to order and help us buy this equipment that will help us make more cool merchandise <laughs> and feel my obsession with arts and crafts. <laughs>